and then make letterboxes to give to people so I can then give them a present. So I need to go and make things. Can can me giving them a mailbox count as a present? Does that, does that count? I don't think that counts. Hi guys and welcome back to the next episode of Chamber of Iris and I am back on the server today and I've done a lot of work actually. I'm, I'm, I've done more than I really should have off camera and I'm sorry. <laughs> um, so basically I went on and as you can see like at the back there there's some lights and that's where like some of the other people in our village chose to build their houses so I came to the top of the hill, cleared out a space and then built and I ended up building for very long and I mean th this happened. This is my house. I have this now. So yeah so this has done mainly survival. I say mainly we were allowed to use creative but like to be able to fly and place blocks quicker we had to already get the stuff. So as you can see there were my furnaces and I went and mined a lot of stone. I mean, a lot. I've n I never want to see another piece of cobblestone in my life ever again. But yeah, so this is what we have. Um, I had one reference image of like a Tudor house, but then I just sort of gave up because I could only get the front view of it. So I just did my own thing. So I'll give you a wee quick tour. There's nothing in the inside apart from like the stairs and the roof. So we have this will be my wee kitchen area. This will be my living room. Round here is going to be my storage room and there is a back door here which takes me out this side and then if you go up the stairs you've got in here will be my bedroom you've got up here which is cute little like viewing area don't really know what I'll do up here um over this here is going to be all my magic stuff so like my enchanting table and then there's like there's magical mod so there's all that stuff in here that we still need to do and then this will be my wee bathroom because you don't really use a bathroom much on Minecraft, it's just more for like aesthetic. But yeah, this is what I have. I probably should not have done as much as I did. But I did, and that's done. So, oh well. Oh my goodness, a pixie just flew into my house. No, stay in. Stay in forever. Stay in forever. You're mine. I just put this down, but I don't have enough of it, so I'm gonna need to pick it all back up. I need my iron pick. But you stay in. Don't go anywhere. Don't think about it. This is so pretty, it like changes colours. I just need more of it to set as my like kitchen floor. Did it leave? No, no, come back. Pe Pexy, come back, please. No, Pexy, please. Pexy, come back to me. Okay, so now that the house is basically finished, um, I'll give you a quick show around. We do have a door and we now have this lovely area. We've got some like support beams that look quite cute. Um, got floor and all that down. What we need is an obvious thing that we don't have is some sand. So we need to go and get some sand but we also need to make a shovel first to be honest because otherwise I'll have to pick everything up by hand. I'm not about that life. So we are going to go and get some sand so we can turn it into glass so that I can actually like have some windows and stop things coming into my house. This area is so pretty. One thing I'm going to need to see about getting set up soon is like a farm because I'm constantly running- oh what was that? Oh, I had a panic attack from that. Need to get some food because at the moment I'm living off apples and it's not the best. Okay we have some sand and now we just need to go and like put it in the chest for it to smell. Um, if I put half in there. So what we're also going to do is we're going to have a quick back like go back to spawn and have a look at the chamber and see what one of the books is. Now this one here. So this book is called Decorations and find a gift and deliver it to a friend's mailbox. All your interior decorations you want is the price. Which basically means I can go into creative and give myself whatever I want. So what I need to do is it just deliver it to a friend's mailbox. Now I don't think anyone has mailboxes yet. How do you make mailboxes? A wood and a book. We need sugar cane and some leather. So that's what we're going to have to do. We're going to need to go and find some cows, get some leather, get some books, make books, and then make letter boxes to give to people so I can then give them a present. So I need to go and make things. Can can me giving them a mailbox count as a present? Does that, does that count? I don't think that counts. Here's the pixies. They're so cute. 
I don't have jars though. What is that thing? What the heck is that? Hello? I don't know what this is. Probably some weird voodoo magic that I should not be near. I like your blood temple. Heck yeah. Okay. It was just some TNT. Didn't really need it. But I might take this actually. Because then it means I can make some bathroom things. Because you need quartz for bathrooms. There we go. Right. So now we need to... Oh, there's another lucky block here. Lots of dispensers. Just what I wanted. <gasps> there's a horse over there. It's dying. I mean, if I get to it first, I'm going to kill it. But still, it's dying. I should save it. By killing it. I'm coming, horsey. Try not to die before I get there. I will save you. And put you out your misery. See? I saved you. Did you only drop two leather? What the heck? I came all this way to save you and all you did was drop two leather. That's just rude. Oh, there's some crocodiles. Hello, crocodiles. Do not come for me. There's a fish. I want to kill the fish because then I can turn it into... Ow. I have no idea what that noise was, but it doesn't sound friendly. Oh, it's a crocodile. I was correct. It's not friendly. Oh, no, they can swim faster than me, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Stay away. I don't want to have to fight you. Ah well. In the last episode I'd said that this reminded me of Arcadia, which it does, but I was wondering does it remind any of you of Arcadia? Like were any of you around here for those days or did any of you like go back and watch it so you like know what it was? Um, Arcadia is an old series, like old. Um, it was one of my first series I think that I actually started on this channel. It was actually the series that made me become friends with the likes of Brit and Lauden. I kind of want a sapling from one of these. I mean, my backpacks are... Okay, I have two basically full backpacks. Yay, sapling! <gasps> What's this? Silverwood? Oh, this is... Is this the tree that I'm not meant to cut down? Because in the Ars Magica mod, there's trees that you're not meant to cut down because, like, they're bad if you cut them down. But I'm pretty sure that the wood looks really pretty. Yeah, like, look, the wood looks really pretty. I won't take more in case that is, like, I'm not meant to break it. Hello, Beto. Don't mind me, I'm just going for the horses. Sorry. I'm sorry. I don't want to have to do it. It's so weird walking and not being able to sprint. Why is that tree white? <gasps> okay. So one thing that's cool to know about the... I'm not sure what mod pack it is that adds these big great trees here. But if they have spider webs on them, it usually means that underneath is a spawner for spiders and a chest with some loot and I want that chest so what I need to do is get up there break the wood and break the spawner quickly oh no 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 I want we can hit by that was that I need to destroy that oh. see some loot I don't know what that's gonna do I'm still poisoned but yeah so that's what's under there I'm not really sure if the amount of damage I nearly took was worth it but still I'm going to grab this sugar cane and then I'm going to head back because this should be enough to make some paper and still have some to grow. Okay, so now we have our books and we now need to make the mailbox which is wood like this and then two mailboxes. So what we need to do is place one down for me and then go and give someone something. What can I give someone as a present? Um, what do we have? I'm going to give someone my emerald. That's a good present, right? An emerald? I'd say so. Um, so we're going to pop my mailbox down and then right click it. So that's mine. And now I need to go and give it to someone. Now, not that many people have houses. But I know Tom has a house down here that he started building. So I could give him a house. A house, a mailbox. There's Tom's house. Ooh, he's got a nice blue arch thing now. Tom's house. Um, there. And I just want to put an emerald in it. I'm just going to put an emerald in here. Because I don't have... I can't put it in there without claiming it. So. And now, so let's see the book. Find a gift. Deliver it to your friend. Prizes all interior decorations you want. Which now means I can go ham and decorate my house. Which I'm excited about. Um, I feel like we also need to make... Moving between houses is a bit easier in this village because at the moment it's all just trees and forest. I'm in love with this house though. I'm very happy with how it worked out. It is so good. Okay, so now that we have completed our task, we're going to start decorating and to start with, I'm going to do the living room. 
So what I'm probably going to do is just give you small updates as I go, as I complete things, because that probably seems like the best option. Okay, so that's the living room done. We've got this nice white mantel piece with a painting, a fishbowl, a bird cage, a cute couch with a table, and over this side is sort of like the study area with all the books, some chairs, and a clock. So now we're going to go on to the kitchen, and that's what we need to do next. So there we go, there is the kitchen done. I just did the chamber out block floor because that's what I kind of wanted to do and I think it looks really cool. So I'm very happy with it. It's so shiny and magical and rainbow and it changes colour and I'm in love. And over here it's this wee bacon station desk thing to fill the space but then I've got wee shelves here which I'll put all the baking things I get. So like the knives and the pots and pans and all that will be up here making it look cute. And then we've got this little dining table here, which sort of is our wee dining room. We could do with a wee welcome rug. What rugs do we have? What carpet do we have, rather? Just normal carpet, so maybe do it in like a white. And there we go, a wee nice blue and white check as you come in. We also need a coat rack, actually, which won't work with the rug, so might need to just do it as a wee blue rug, like that. We've also got this bookshelf here because any books that I complete, so it would be like these three, I'm going to shove in here to make it look busy. So as I complete challenges, these bookshelves will fill up. I'm actually going to get rid of those and make it just like that. So now we're done with the downstairs and move upstairs onto the bedroom. Okay, so this is the bedroom and um, I went for like a cyan kind of theme and then we have these shelves here because what I'm going to do is use this as my backpack place. 
So then I can collect all my different backpacks and put them up there. And then I can build the shelves along if I need to fill up the wall. But I thought I needed a wee place for my extra bat backpack to start my collection. Okay, so that's me got the tiny wee bathroom. I just need to add a cute carpet, which I think I'm just gonna go for red. And then we're just gonna pop that down. And that's the wee bathroom done, looks super cute. Actually, I could probably do with see if I just get a countertop, like that. And then get a plant pot. For some reason, I can't place it and it's confusing me. Oh well, that looks cute. So I'm not wanting to do too much over here because this is like my enchanting area and that so I don't want to touch that. But I can use some fairy lights which will look super cute. So do I just right click, how do I work fairy lights? I was actually wanting curtains and I think the banners would do that quite well. Oh, I can't do it there though because that stuff's in the way. But that looks cute. I might go and add those to the kitchen and the living room. That looks cute. I like the banners as curtains idea. Well done accidental me noticing that. So I've dotted some fairy lights around. They don't actually give off light so I had to put some of the wee lights in. But I have done the fairy lights so it now looks kawaii AF. Now I'm not going to put down my enchant table and light because that's cheating. I don't want to use that because that's not just decorative stuff. Um. But yeah, everything else looks pretty good. Now, if you come up with any ideas of what I could do with like this space here, or if you think of anything else I could do, let me know in the comment section below because I can just go into creative and add it because it's just decorative items. The one thing I do want to add though, is we have a hot tub. So I want to add a hot tub, like so. And then I want to get some stairs and just add stairs up to it and then you can just get in and enjoy the hot tub look at me chilling out in my hot tub looking cool here we go i just added some like what like hanging basket kind of things like along the windows to make them look oh i just hit my mouse and we went for a spin but yeah i just added those to make it look super cute i'm very happy with the house i hope you all like the house let me know what you think in the comment section below and if you have any ideas for any other spaces like the upstairs hallway or if you think Scott you could do this with that bit let me know in the comments below. I am going to figure out another way to include you all in this series similar to how on Harmony Hollow we have the art wall. On this I'll try and do something more along the names of like naming things after what your ideas are or putting names on a sign or something along those lines but yeah. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, remember to leave a like. Comment down below. We smashed the like goal last time of a thousand likes, so let's see if we can smash a like goal of two thousand on the series. Subscribe if you are new to the channel, and I will see you all next time. Bye.